Insiders covering the McDonald's All-American game here in Chicago, and I'm joined by Chase Jeter, committed to Duke. So what can you tell me about the conversations you had with Coach K during your recruitment? Um, you know, uh, before I committed, I, uh, I had a lot of schools on my list, you know. Uh, towards the end, it came down to about six, and uh, Duke was a main separator for me just because of the relationship I had with Coach K. And, and when we talked, he would just talk about, uh, he would tell me how special of a player I was and, uh, you know, how well I would fit into the organization. And, you know, being able to watch them this year and see how, see how Jaleel fits right in. Um, and I feel like me and him are different players, but um, I could fill a role. Um, playing the five or four in that position, so I feel real confident, um, you know, going in there next year and my relationship with Coach. Your new future teammate, someone who's here as well, is Luke Kennard. You guys room together. We're friends from the past. What can you tell me about your relationship with each other? Um, me and him, we've developed a close bond off the court. Uh, haven't been able to play on the same team too much uh, based on the competitions we've been at. Um, but me and him, we just uh, we hang out. You know, me and him have been roommates at, in past uh, camps at USA and uh, out here at McDonald's. So that worked out pretty good for us. And you know, we just developed from there. Who eats more, you or Luke? Uh, pretty sure that's me. Yeah, that one's got to be me. Let's, let's talk food now. Your favorite pregame ritual when it comes to food. What, what's on the plate? Um, pregame ritual. You know, I'm a healthy eater, so. I'll usually go with uh, maybe like a banana, uh, maybe some peanut butter crackers, something light. You don't want to eat too heavy before a game, but um, you know, just just a healthy little snack like that before the game. I could take a tip from you, eating healthy. Who would you say you model your game after in the NBA? A player in the NBA? Uh, Tim Dun Tim Duncan, no question. Him and uh, Lamarcus Aldridge. Um, you know, as far as the pick and pop goes, and uh, with Tim Duncan, his footwork, uh, being able to use that jump hook and get to that right away. That's a uh, those are my go-to moves, and being able to uh, replicate guys like that is uh, is how I, you know, uh, enter that into my repertoire. So your school that you're about to attend in the Final Four, so give me your pick to win the national championship. I think I know where you're going to go, but I'm going to ask you anyway. I got Duke, no question. <laughs> yeah, no question, man. Uh, if they get this win against Michigan State, I think uh, Kentucky will end up uh, taking down Wisconsin. So uh, I think Duke is going to end up being Kentucky in the Final Four. Right, Chase, thanks for the time. Good luck next season. Thank you. Thank you.